What is up guys, welcome to my channel and today we are back guys, we are back with some more of the Jobless Reincarnation Season 2 But apparently this is called Episode 0, I'm not really sure what's the meaning of that I hope it's not a recap because I just watched the full season just, just then, okay, so I don't know But anyway, we did left off in a pretty uh, good note um, it's just, it's just sad that you guys, I don't know, how long did you guys even have to wait? Not too long, I think, I don't know. But yeah, so, uh, my boy Rudy is up, okay, my boy ain't giving up, man. That that last episode definitely was good. Not the one that I'm talking about, the Ares' uh, journey, you know what I'm saying? Because that was, that happened between, so the last, last episode was episode 23. So, yeah, Rudy's getting up, looking for, uh, getting up to look for his mom was definitely a good one there. Like, it, it do be hitting hard, not gonna lie, man. The story in this uh, anime generally does uh feel really like you know re real and like really it, it hits you hard like like i said i've said it multiple times you would not really be expecting the things that happen in this show like it just happens up all of a sudden and you're just left there speechless like you can't even like say anything but anyway that is what i like i like the journey i like the you know this <laughs> sad truth that happens you know what i'm saying so anyway not gonna babble on we did left up pretty good and we also saw sylphie i believe around the end so that was pretty crazy sylphie has been telling about rudy's to some other people we are not sure who she was talking to still but yeah i haven't watched any of the freaking trailers i am watching no trailer yeah no we out here going it blind i know nothing it's cool i'm loving it but yeah anyway guys i'm not gonna babble on too much with that being said let's just go ahead and check this episode zero what it's all about but anyway let's go what is that zenith no way if zenith was living like this she would have already contacted us <laughs> come on right season like what labyrinth or something because even freaking kirika couldn't see her properly so that is pretty crazy that's sylvie oh are we going back again uh maybe okay are we seeing sylvia's uh story that pits Sylphie, why is she planned? Or is this how she got teleported maybe? With the thing. So she... I mean she's gonna drop down here. <laughs> I think it was these people that uh, Sylphie was actually explaining about Rudy's too. Oh my man got... What the? He getting GG by a boar! I'm assuming Sylphie saved him? Right? Doesn't be loud, is it? Yeah, no. Okay, nice. Yep. Perfect candidate. Another guard for princess, I guess, right? <laughs> so we just took that thing down with one shot. Without even... Uh, she wasn't really trying to, obviously. She was just trying to minimize the impact, right? <laughs> so we are getting Sylviet's uh, part of the story. I mean, I don't mind. Cool. I like it. I still can't forget it, man. I thought she was a dude too, by the way. You know what I'm saying? You can't blame me. <laughs> but he was a she, uh. That's Astra. Did she want Astra? What the fuck? So Sylphie is Nostra. Damn, okay. It's a pretty big uh, kingdom for sure, this one. Uh, I got teleported. How long has it been that Sylphie got teleported and that she already knows? So I'm assuming maybe people from Ashra actually see she knows everything. Okay, princess. New face and new name. So change everything, huh? Interesting. <laughs> so that is so weird. Okay, that was classic. There you go. I mean, all right. Everybody probably thinks she's a dude, too, right? I mean, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. Googie game, yeah, googie game, yeah, yeah. That must be annoying as telling everybody. <laughs> oh, this pig. Oh, uh, shit. I don't want to pause, but... Oh, uh, when Gramps got assassinated, Sylphie was there, too. Sylphie was there, too. The glasses. Oh, my God. That just ticked in my head now. Gotta give it to her. She's got words, alright. Way with words. Elf. What's his name? Yep. So they <laughs> pretty much told 
Everybody that is a hate. Okay, still weird out here. Still hate the fact that these people freaking assassinated Gramps. Fucking. I wonder if Sylvia knew. <laughs> oh god, okay. It's not going well, no! <laughs> Sylvia needs to relax. Uh, it's not gonna go well now, is it? Damn, girl. Okay, she giving them chills, yeah? She good. Damn, she covered it up. Damn, gotta give it to the princess. Now that I think about it, we never... No, wait, we did, we did, I'm sorry. I was just thinking if we saw, like, Sylvia's dad and mom. I don't think we did, did we? No, I don't think so, right? No, yeah, we did not. So is she taking it seriously now? Does she actually want to claim the throne? Like, want to... Because, you know... She was like, I don't really care. Facts. There you go, you know what I'm saying? Long as Prince out there, I guess. <laughs> okay, okay. So, I get it, I get it. Take you, <laughs> take care of you. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I guess that would kind of be a reward, I ain't gonna lie, but it's just, uh... Uh... Yeah, he's leaving everything to him. Damn, okay, bro. I mean, I, I don't like that pig ass dude, fucking hell. And the freaking prince too. They were the one who was flame, like framing the gramps. Don't tell me prince zebra. Huh? Boy, what? Okay, prince is crack. Uh, the prince is just joking. Okay, okay, thank God she's joking. She got me, yo. She got me. I was like, what's up? Damn. Uh, I still don't know. She might she might not be, you know. That day, the monster. Oh, so he actually died. God damn. Oh, shit. I was wondering where he was. Yo. I mean, Sophie definitely can. For sure. <laughs> she, she's also not normal. <laughs> she's pretty much freaking, well, like, probably right on the route because she can, she's also pretty talented, alright? She went straight? This girl. Jesus. She was just. Oh, she, she's an assassin, you can just tell. She gone? No, she right there, yep. Damn. Going straight for Princess, huh? Damn, okay. Oh, she got... What she got? Okay, okay, let's go. Using the powerful one. GG, my lady. I'm sorry to you, but... Yeah. <laughs> but if... Uh, Sylvia was not here, then Princess actually would have been dead by now. I died, a famous assassin, there you go. But clearly it's right in front of you, to be honest. Go aboard using you. That is a pretext. Hmm. She kind of did, that's, that's kind of true. Okay, okay. At least he's been honest. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I see. <laughs> this is why Sylvia's with them. Okay, makes sense. Alright, this is good. At least Sylvia has found some friends. Okay. 
Let's go, girl. Yeah. Okay. All right. She for real. Princess has decided. Adio. I got. I got to try to remember her name. All right. All right. All right. Uh, quite a first episode. I ain't gonna lie, guys. So we just saw how Sylvia ended up or where she is. So she's in Ashra Kingdom, and clearly there's some pretty uh big uh, throne war going on right now. Seems like with the you know princess and prince. Uh, but uh, so I got a pretty big suspicious. I wouldn't say it's just. I, I wouldn't be surprised now if it was actually the Ashra Kingdom who was involved in that mana out outburst. Okay, I'm just. I know like uh, you could kind of tell like uh, Princess already probably was, because she was already aware. If you know what I'm saying, because everybody got teleported and destroyed at the same time, right? When the explosion happened, mana outburst, everybody was getting teleported. But Princess was already aware of that. So either I am kind of confused on that timeline a little bit. Or she was already aware what was happened. The place been destroyed. Everybody been teleported around. Because she already knew that. And I am assuming that is like after a while is when they get... Eris's grandpa and execute him because I also remember we seeing uh Sylphiate on the place where uh Gramps was actually getting assassinated the only reason that I remember was we seen her with the glasses at that time I didn't know if it was Sylphiate but now it's confirmed because the glasses when the princess said you need to hide your identity here then it ticked in my head what we saw her so yeah that was Sylphiate there I'm assuming Sylphiate was uh, obviously she don't really know I don't think she was aware or even if she was, maybe she just let it happen. But in my opinion, I'm pretty sure she was not really aware that uh, was the Grams that Rudy was teaching the daughter, like or the granddaughter, right? I'm pretty sure she was not aware. But even if she was, what can she do at that point, right? So, but yeah, that was pretty crazy. And we also got to see the freaking brother of hers was also involved in framing the Grams and that freaking pig looking dude, the freaking Baldi. So, yeah, quite a lot of uh, things being answered here uh, regarding Sylphiet. And obviously, <laughs> she was also being teleported all of a sudden. And she just happened to save the princess. Yes, it just happened to be pretty much because she's trying to make her landing uh, obviously not too impactful and happened to hit the boar and take it down in one shot pretty much. But sadly, the guy who was actually trying to defend the princess actually died. I was surprised about that. I thought like he was okay, but that was not the case. He actually did die. So that's a bit sad over there. And princess does seem fine right now. Uh, I can't really see anything bad about her right now anyway <laughs> you know what i'm saying she does look fine but it is true she, uh it was good that she was actually being honest to sylvia about saying that i just used you as a kind of like you know make an excuse that you're upon a kind of trespassing in the uh, palace and stuff like you know which is true i mean at least she was being honest to sylvia so sylvia decided then on like i'm just making this on my own like you know this decision on my own because Princess out here about to get assassinated just like that. That is crazy. Like, this didn't even hold back. This is when at it. Like, that, uh, that, that's insane. But obviously, thankfully, Sylvia was there. Otherwise, yeah, Princess would have definitely actually been killed there for sure. So it's good that Princess called Sylvia that night to sleep over. If that was not the case, then yeah, they were, she was pretty much dead. So Sylvia saved her out again, so which is good. So it seems like they're actually planning to go to study abroad. I believe that's what that guy was saying. I guess in a way it does kind of make sense because if they are willing to basically just send out assassin in the middle of the night all of a sudden, then yeah, it's best not to be there right now. Probably just go outside and plan from outside, right? So yeah, I mean, royals and stuff, it does kind of get annoying to be honest. I don't really like it, but yeah we'll just see how it goes on top of that is the Ashra kingdom so yeah a lot is happening here but yeah we finally got to see what sylvia's sylvia's up to and what she was doing i'm hoping next episode we get to see how zenith what she's doing i'm hoping anyway right because i was hoping this episode but i don't mind getting sylvia it's uh, a part of you as well but i'm pretty sure this is like right after when she got teleported it's already been like over two years so and I'm assuming the, oh, after two years, and I'm pretty sure on the last episode, 
of the first season, we saw like uh, Sylvia telling them about Rudius, right? And uh, there were multiple people out there, so clearly they are planning something big. They're recruiting people, right? The princess is recruiting people from the study or the wherever they're studying, and uh, they're planning to recruit uh, Rudius as well. I believe that's what their plan is. But yeah, that is that was the current time. Uh, when like Rudius got up and looking for his mom, I believe. But yeah, anyway, guys, it was a great episode. You know, we did enjoy it. Like I said, you cannot go wrong with Jobless Reincarnation. Every single episode is great. I've been enjoying it. But hopefully, we, next episode we get a bit, we get some info. I mean, I know we know the info where she is, but I want to see what happened to Zenith. Where is she? What is she doing? Like she's in the labyrinth. What what's happening? You know, what I'm saying that's what I want to know. But anyway, guys, with that being said, I hope you guys did like this more reaction. If you guys did, make sure you guys smash the like button. Don't forget to subscribe button and the notification bell, guys. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.